Oh, how? Wow. Hey, what's up, people? My name is Mark, aka the original Flapjack, and today we're gonna talk about Keemstar. Okay. And before you leave a comment saying, "Oh my God, you're using Keemstar's name." to get views, oh my god. First listen to what I have to say, okay? Before you start pointing your finger and saying, you're the bad guy. So if you didn't already know, in the last few days, Keemstar has been getting a lot of shit off a lot of people. People making up lies about him, people, people who claim to be his friends, turning their back on him, not actually listening to what he has to say, or taking into consideration that he actually might be telling the truth. And there's been a few videos of people calling Keemstar out and bringing up his past, that he said the n-word. But I mean, come on, let's face it. Who hasn't said the n-word? I know I say it all the time. I'm not a racist. Put it this way, if you're listening to your hip-hop rap music and the guy says the n-word in it and you might be singing along to this said song, I guarantee you've said the n-word multiple times. Oh, but Mark, I'm not saying that in the same context Keemstar's saying it. Yeah, but you're still saying it. And it's a bad word, so you probably shouldn't be saying it. Doesn't matter what context it's in, don't say the n-word. And Keemstar has come out in the past, and he's said it himself. Yeah, I made a mistake. I've said the n-word. He's also put it on, uh, he's also put it on Twitter. He's made multiple videos on Twitter of him saying, well, I, you know, I've, I've said this in the past, blah, blah, blah. I even made a video of it. There's audio out there exposing Keemstar of me saying, fuck the fans, okay? So, my final thought is this, like, you can take little bites and you can take things out of context and you can put them in a montage to try to hurt someone's career or try to ruin someone's career, but if that person is me that you're trying to do it to, I'm just gonna come back with no facts. Like, you're gonna end my career. <laughs> fuck the fans, okay? Fuck the fans, yes, because I don't tell the truth. I am wrong. And I'll tell everybody the story on everything. Alex is an N-word, yes. He put up a few videos on Twitter saying that people were cutting and chopping that video. So I took those videos he put on Twitter and cut it up and made it sound even worse. As a joke, I wasn't hating. I like Keemstar. Keemstar's a nice guy. And Keemstar might have his, you know, bad side or whatever you want to call it. But at the end of the day, he's an entertainer. He has 1.6 million subs. I don't think 1.6 million people hate him. And the latest drama alert, when it wasn't him in the video, there was some new guy. People saying, oh I wish Keemstar would never come back. Well let's face it, he was there from the start. He made drama alert what it is. He's always going to be there. Doesn't matter if you love him or you hate him. He's an entertainer. That's the whole point. He's not there to make you like him. He's there to entertain. 1.6 million people have subscribed. So I'm going to assume, okay, I'm going to assume that people enjoy the videos, people enjoy the content, people enjoy him, okay? Because I didn't like the new guy. No offense to the new guy, I don't know who he is, I've never seen him before. You know, he did a good job, but I would still much rather listen to Keemstar talk about all this news than anyone else. Because he kind of makes it entertaining the way he presents himself. The popcorn thing, that was genius! So at the end of the day, guys, don't hate Keemstar. Just accept him for who he is. You know, all he ever asks for is one like on a video. I mean, is that so bad? And you can't keep throwing the fact that he said the n-word into your videos like it's such a bad thing. He's he's apologized for it. He's admitted to doing it, which is the main thing. You know, he's accepted that, but yet people keep bringing it back up. And I'm pretty sure these YouTubers that are calling them out, all these big YouTubers, I'm pretty sure they've said the n-word. Like I've said, rapping along to your favorite music by your favorite hip-hop artist that might be african-american who knows and he says the n-word and you're just singing along and then all of a sudden you've said the n-word and i mean let's face it the n-word's usually said about four or five times in the song so you've said it probably more times than he said it think about it so don't hate on keemstar make him come back make him continue doing drama alert like we all want him to do because keemstar is drama alert and drama alert is keemstar Yes, he's threatened people, dox people, but let's face it, the internet is a cruel place. It's better having an enemy you know, than an enemy you don't know. By the way guys, if you liked the video, please leave a like and a comment down below, subscribe to the channel, and sorry for talking so fast. Whew. Don't forget, if you subscribe, you get a free taco, that is not a scam, I promise I will send it to you in the post, like a package, not a scam. And if I don't see you in the next video, 
Good afternoon, good evening, and good night.